every Republican must run against the Democrats and the left, not just his or her opponent. This is never, almost never done, maybe never done. Voters, please understand that when you vote Democrat, you get chaos. You get an undermining of everything good in this country. This, you are voting for the left. Even if you are a liberal, you are voting for the left. You are not voting for liberals. So, in a nutshell, the, we have to make the referendum on the left while they make the referendum about one man. We are making about an ideology that is crushing the country. Why don't Republicans do that? Too many of them don't understand it. They don't understand what we're in the midst of the great debate, the great debate between socialism and free enterprise. Uh, we are in the midst of also the great debate be- be- between tyranny and freedom. Yes. And, and uh, look, a lot of people who run for office, who get elected to Congress, it becomes their identity. Mm-hmm. There, there, there's something where you look in the mirror and, and you see the reflection back and you say, I'm a senator. I'm really damn important. There, there's an old joke that, that politics is Hollywood for ugly people. There's enormous truth to that. Mm -hmm. And what happens is people desperately want to stay in elected office. It becomes who Hmm. they are. And and the the terror of being out of elected office, Mm -hmm. it it, it is a horrifying void because they don't know who they are. And what that means is they're deeply risk averse. The way you get reelected is you don't take on any issue that matters because there's risk. And if there's risk, you might get voted out of office. And look, I got to admit, this job ain't that great unless you're fighting for something that matters. And, and, and I feel intensely grateful that I get to fight, you know, as, as with Esther at such a time as this, at a time when it matters, when it matters for the country. I mean, to have the chance, it's the reason Michael and I do the Verdict podcast. 